All right, guys, the last thing I wanted to cover, uh, at least today, um, w with Boto3 is how we can uh, list a bucket and just write it to a text file. So this is something pretty useful that I, I do with some of my projects. Um, so I'm gonna make a new Python file, and call it list objects to um, file or to text file. And this is handy, so let's copy this. Get rid of this. Let's bring this closer. And let's just grab this and slightly modify it so it's just listing stuff. Don't want it to download. I'll explain all this later. I'm just trying to set it up. So we don't want to download, so we're going to get rid of that. We actually don't need any of this. So let's just print file dot key. Okay, cool. So what it's doing is it's looking in this Lambda GDAW folder. Actually, let's not filter. Let's just print all. We just want anything in this bucket that ends with .lrc. Doesn't matter where it is. Okay. So now let's just, let's print this to a text file. So we need to Google Python, how to write to text file. And I always like going to Stack Overflow. That is what we need right here. So let's actually, let's think about this. Where do we want to like open this text file? So we want to do it there. And then inside here, we want this for loop, right? And then if this condition is met, we want to print it to the text file. So file name, it's complaining because we don't have a file name. So let's call this uh, text file location and set it equal to um, just a file. So what is this photo three project? Just gonna copy that, put this in a string. And this is just where you want your text file to be. So I'm just gonna call it, um, photo three list dot text and it'll actually make this file. So text file location as text file. Actually, I don't like the location. Let's just call it text file. Actually text file location, text file location. And this will say as text file. text file dot write. All right. And what do we want to write? We want to write file dot 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 key plus a new line. Okay. So let's just talk about what's happening here. So it's opening this text file and this a means append. So this means, um, if there's already stuff in this file, it's going to write at the bottom of the file. So, if we had something else like write, for example, it would it would overwrite. Every time we ran this, it would just overwrite whatever, but we're just gonna use append. Um, and yeah, so now we're opening that file and once it's open, we're gonna loop through all the objects and if it meets this certain criteria, we're going to print it to our console here and then also, this is how you write to that text file. So text file dot write and what do you wanna write? The file dot key. Uh, so let's give that a try. Okay, looks like it worked. And you can see, see here, it already created a list here. So let's just open it. There you go. We're looking at it in um, PyCharm, but yeah, let's just look at it here in a text file. So there you go. That's how you can list um, to a text file. And again, this is something that, that's really useful. I've used it before 
for uh, projects like real world projects um yeah hope you enjoyed it hope you uh can find this useful we actually don't even need os so yeah that's a super simple way to to write it to a text file uh yeah if you like this uh please like and subscribe and thanks for watching